Hello guys and welcome back in a new video. Uh, you are seeing now on the background, I mean I have the webcam somewhere <laughs> in the screen. Uh, I'm uh, reviewing a Kickstarter campaign. I've been uh, contacted uh, by Eric Samut from this tech automation and uh, they contacted me because they saw my channel is related about 3D printing and they are creating an upgrade kit for 3D printers. Uh, really particular and interesting, at least is for what I saw and what they mentioned to me. Uh, this I want to say this is not a paid review, so I will say uh, f uh, freely uh, what I think about it. <laughs> In the meantime, I'm speaking. They just they just launched the the, ca the campaign and they just hit the goal. <laughs> Uh, and uh, how you saw, I review at the time BCN 3D. Uh, they did a really cool machine about double extrusion because the extruder are not together, so they can uh, move uh, 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 individually uh, on the print and exchange all time the extruder. And this allow to doesn't have too many problems with the uh, dual extrusion technology. At the same time, I think this is a technology we need to invest more money and company need to work more because it can be really useful, like to create like different, uh, really difficult shape and create uh, uh, with one material the actual shape and like with uh, the dissolvable uh, uh, like material the support. So after you print, you can just put your object in water and. Uh, uh, the, you, it will be super easy to remove the support. In the meantime, I will let go the campaign on the background when, I, and I will speak over to let you understand my feedback about this campaign. Uh, pretty much is a really easy uh, kit. Uh, pretty much are two motor uh, with the f uh, feeder. Uh, in the middle, they have a um, white part this one uh, where the filaments will go through and that part will pretty much decide which one will go through uh, which filaments. Of course it will be the motor to push the filaments but uh, uh, in that white part will be enter two filaments and exit just one and it will go through the extruder. How you are seeing seems they do really clean print and I received some of the print they did so I will put all, uh, in overlay some of the picture and uh, to show you uh, the definition and the quality of the print. It seems really cool. Uh, at the same time, how you see, they did a lot of print with different models and it looks pretty much uh, amazing, I mean, almost perfect. And uh, how it's showing now, pretty much you will just connect uh, with the actual board you have already in your printer and uh, you will be able to, I think you need to insert some code, uh, some line of code in the G code to be able to retract uh, for the, the real length uh, the uh, filaments before switch with the other one. But it doesn't seem nothing like too difficult. I think I, I think everyone will be able to upgrade their printer. And uh, it's something cool because you have just one extruder. Uh, it's nothing I really see uh, uh, right now installed in different printer. I think so maybe I saw in one or two printer something like this. And uh, at the same time, having just one extruder is a lot better because you doesn't have the problem of double calibration for both extruder. In particular, if they are in the same block, uh, it will be uh, really difficult to calibrate well the machine and not like BCN 3D have two individual extruder and uh, you will be able to uh, use this upgrade I think with uh, pretty much every slicer because you will be able to uh, put uh, the instruction to retract the filaments in the right way uh, and pretty much is this uh, is it seems a really promising uh, campaign they just uh, hit the goal uh, in the meantime we are speaking and the price is good uh, I think for a full kit is around 259 Canadian dollars and uh, seems a really nice company is is not someone is just I think jumping this technology they was already doing extruder and um, and uh, they will, they say in the campaign, they will ship in November, so it's quite soon. Uh, they seems really cool guy, and 
they have a kind of, of nice background on uh, the technology, so it's not like a new t a new company is jumping inside 3D printing. So I would suggest you if you want to have a look at the full uh, campaign with the audio on the, on the Kickstarter campaign and uh, if you like it, if you want to experiment a bit more with this technology you can uh, think about to uh, pledge this Kickstarts. Just a little uh, recommendation before uh, thinking about pledge for a Kickstarter campaign, remember you are kind of doing a donation so you can sometimes lose your money or uh, without having the product or other stuff. Uh, I think everyone heard uh, about different campaign, they went really badly, but I don't think this is the case. I think this is a real company and how I show you, you can see them uh, go through on the website, on their website. They are not a company, it just starts, uh, they was already doing uh, extruder and they think about it create these upgrade kits for uh, printers. Uh, let me know down below in the comments what you think about it, if you will think about to buy an upgrade kit. I will maybe speak with them to see if I can uh, have access to one, uh, but I will need to pretty much probably uh, have uh, another kind of printer to be able to upgrade because I will not be able to upgrade like my Ultimaker or like bcn 3 d or my Wasp. Uh, but we'll see in the future. Uh, so hope you like this video. Uh, stay tuned for other video will come soon. I think yeah, this week another video, and uh, we we'll see at the next one. And remember, raise your eyebrow.